Syracuse Mets fans flooding NBT Bank Stadium this afternoon for the sixth annual open house. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc shows us how fans are getting ready for the start of the season, which is now only a month away. Hey. Hitting the batting cages, touring the stadium, and getting season tickets. This year's open house bringing in old and new Syracuse baseball fans. It's just the perfect dream come true. It's just the, the, the effect of having a New York team, having the New York Mets here in Syracuse uh, is really in evidence today that it's going to be an exciting year. Though this is the sixth annual open house, Morrill says this is the largest crowd he's ever seen, almost doubling in size. And many say we have the Mets affiliation to thank for that. We're going to talk quickly about what's new for this coming season. Fans getting a different feel this year. You can expect to see new food, a new app where you can find your friends' seats, and you'll be able to meet the entire team. Smarl announcing there will be a fundraiser two days before for game day, where fans can dine with the players and coaches. We're never going to stop. We are always going to do what we can do to interact and make our experience here at the Syracuse Mets better for the fans. An experience many fans have been sitting on the edge of their seats waiting for, hoping to put the minor league team on the map. With the new organization coming in, new players coming in, it's maybe a little bit more excitement this year to see what type of team we'll end up having. We raise that Syracuse flag high and say Central New York is here. Uh, we're the New York Mets. We're made in New York. We're built in New York. So it's important to have the, the Syracuse Mets here. And for many, it's more than just a baseball game. In Syracuse, Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. Opening day for the Syracuse Mets is Thursday, April 4th. They will be playing the Pawtucket Red Sox. And tickets are on sale now. You can also get them on game day.